Today I wanted to share a video on how I get rid of mealybugs, spider mites, and other pests on my succulent leaves. We're going to be working with 70% alcohol and a little brush. If you look closely, you can see the little mealybug hiding at the base of the leaf on the stem. So all I do is dip my paintbrush in some alcohol and rub it on there. You can see how the little pests just melt away. I'm going to finish a string and dolphin plant up, making sure I get all the stems and underneath the leaves. And then we'll come back and I'll show you what it looks like when we're done. Remember, grab a string, dip your brush in the alcohol solution, start at the top, and then work your way down. And I might have to treat for a few days in a row depending on how much spider mites I have popping up in the next couple of days. So just treat as you see them and uh, remember to test on a small portion of your plant somewhere on the bottom first um, before you go ahead and treat the entire thing. Because sometimes when you use alcohol or any kind of new product for that matter, it can tend to burn some leaves and you don't know which plant is going to be sensitive to that solution. So just make sure you test the bottom portion of your leaves first and then you know you're good to go after waiting 24 hours. If you don't see any signs of burning, you can then go ahead and treat the entire plant. And that's what I did to this string of dolphin right here. In my experience, the string of dolphins can really tolerate the alcohol quite well. Um, I use it straight up, I don't dilute it any because it dries very quickly on the leaves. After you paint this on here like I'm doing, just let it sit out outside with nice airflow out of the direct sun until the leaves have completely dried and then you can go ahead and put it back in its location. When I'm all done treating the leaves of my succulents, I move on to the pot itself. When I'm done, I always like to double check to see if I missed anything. Nope, looks good. I keep treating as needed until the pests are gone. Thank you so much for watching you guys. I really hope you enjoyed this video and it helps you to keep your succulents bug free. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. I'd love to help you in any way I can. See you soon.